Okay, so once you use the small key uh, to open up the statue, you'll see that there is the boss keyhole at the top of the stairs, but you don't really need to worry about that for now. Uh, you just want to hop down to the bottom level and there'll be a mini boss fight. So we got one of these skeletons with some extra arms. Now, uh, the easiest way to kill him is, well, fastest way to kill him is probably to uh, time your blocks when he's swinging at you and it will knock all his arms off and you can get some good hits in on him. Right now he's just using two arms, but there he just broke out the other two. So it really only leaves you with um, one direction that you can swing. And when he puts all four arms up, you have to do a stab motion. Um, but you can see there I just blocked. Oops, missed that block. If you block, he not it knocks all his arms off temporarily. There we go. You can see when he puts all four arms, there's like a little window you can stab through. Okay, not doing so hot. There we go. And there should be um, hearts in all the skulls lining this area. So you can restock once the fight is over. And then head through this door, and inside this treasure chest is the whip, a new item. I would say the whip is probably the least used item uh, out of all your items you get in the game. But you will be using it plenty in, in this temple. Mainly because anytime you get a new item, you'll be using it a lot. Just because they want to show off uh, how it can be used. So, uh, use it on that spigot. And now would be a good time to uh, go up and save your game.